on Monday, we talked about how to write a good sentence for each square of our graphic organizer. Do you remember what are the two questions that you should ask for each square on your graphic organizer? What was the first one? The first one is, who is this sentence about? Now, a couple weeks ago, we were talking about words that are people, places, and things. Do you remember what those words were called? They're nouns. A noun is a person. So when you say who, you are going to be talking about a person or a noun. Now let's go to the second question. What was the second question we were going to ask, you need to ask yourself? What are they doing? What is the person doing? It's an action, a movement, something they're going to do. And just like people are nouns, the action are verbs. Action verbs are different movements that you can do. So to help us learn a little bit about action verbs, we're going to listen to a song by Jack Hartman. During the song, I want you to get up and move with him. And every time you move, think, this is an action verb. After the song is over, we're going to see how many of those action verbs you remember. Are you ready? Here we go. Jack Hartman! All right, did you hear some of those action verbs? So what I'd like you to do now is pause the video and whoever is helping you learn today can write down some of the action words that you heard in the song. After you've had a list of as many as you can remember, push play and restart this video. Welcome back. All right, here we go. Let's see how many of the action verbs in the song did you remember? Did you get gallop? How about crisscross? Did you get jump? Did you remember spin? 
How about fly? Did you remember pump? Swim. And the last one is stomp. How many did you remember? Now, I want to give you one more challenge. I want to see if you could come up with a few extra action verbs that were not in the song. Remember, an action verb is any kind of movement. See if you can come up with one or two more before you begin our writing for today. So what you're going to be doing today is you're going to continue on your graphic organizer um, writing a sentence for each square. Check out the, your sentences that you've written so far. Do you have any action words in them? Go ahead and circle those action words in your writing. If you don't have any, maybe you want to add one in. See if there's a place that you can put one. Action verbs are very important to use when we write. All right, so think of a few more action words, look for some action words in your writing, and then you can finish writing your piece um, for this week on where you like to go in your city. Is it Lilburn, Lawrenceville, or Snellville? Where do you like to go? I can't wait to see, see and hear what you wrote.